Good morning. Happy Friday, everybody. It's time for some more Rise of the Tomb Raider. We had a great time playing the 2013 Tomb Raider, or was it 2015 Raider? Tomb Raider? I think it was, I think it was 2013. We had a great time playing the, the reboot of the Tomb Raider franchise with Tomb Raider in 2013. We are now working on the sequel, Rise of the Tomb Raider. Very similar, if at the same time, very different game. And uh, we've got a bit of an uh, of exploration to do today before we continue on with the primary plot. <clears throat> if I recall correctly, there were a number of tombs that we had just passed. We had discovered them, but we had passed them by because we couldn't figure out how to get to them. Um, we don't have our kit necessary. So I figure let's uh, work on the primary plot. Let's get the kit necessary to unlock these tombs. Then we can go back. That's the goal. Had a wonderful time last night. Hope you guys did too. We got to play Stray. Stray was phenomenal. Really enjoyed um, what I was able to play of that game. It was longer than I anticipated. Uh, people had me prepared for it to end after, you know, three to four hours. But no, I'm, um, I'm a good three hours into the gameplay of Stray. And I've only unlocked about maybe half of the memories and the achievements and stuff. So I'm thinking we'll probably complete Stray next week. But thanks to everybody who showed up. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Uh, what an atmospheric game. Really unique. But we're here to get some more Laura Croft. So let's dive into that in just a minute. Good to see everybody on Facebook today. Harold, Cody, Toby, Josh, Francis, Chakote, Josh and Roman, and good to see everybody on YouTube today. Fishkey, Spencer, Slavin, Craig Euler, Julian Z, Chininator, Automatic Beats, Ian Chamberlain, Adoji, Laura, Quintayus, Pyro, Kamala, Hellcat, Kunk, Sarah, Deuteronomous, um, <clears throat> Ashamed Spork, and Travis Bronham became a bronze ox. Thank you, Travis. And it's Garrett with the first donation of stars on Facebook says, Hi Ox and all in chat, Ox in the Fallout universe, which child story was sad to you? Mine was Billy in Fallout 4. I mean, yeah, uh, Billy's story in Fallout 4 was, um, it was ha tragic and heartbreaking. But the way they set up the quest and the way that the voice actors recorded the dialogue made it come across almost as if they intended it to be humorous. And there was uh, an element of humor to it because uh, it was ridiculous. But uh, yeah, I, was, I thought that that was really tragic. I think uh, the kids in the elementary school in Fallout 3 was one of the ones that kind of just really hit me. Uh, it was the, I think the Springvale ele Elementary School. I did an entire video on it. Um, uh, a while back and um, it's the it's the elementary school that's closest to vault 101 <clears throat> when you first leave the vault and you you see the bloody handprints over the walls and then you uncover the story of the school until you eventually find the big pile of bones and they're all child sized yeah that's one of the ones that um, really hit me hard when I played it it was pretty rough <clears throat> Ah, uh, Hanakimo says, I actually get to catch this stream. You do indeed. I'm live. And we are ready to go. What cigar is that? Says UNPC. This is a C-A-W. It's a perfecto-shaped, <clears throat> shorter C-A-W cigar today. It's my last one. I found this in the bottom of the box. I'm awaiting a shipment of new cigars, so I'm going to have to nurse this one and make it count. Julian Z with a super chat. First super chat of the day says, Hi Ox, so good to see you on this Tomb Friday. Hope you got enough sleep. Can't wait to raid, I mean explore more tombs. Also can't wait for your lore videos this weekend. Have you decided what to play for Monday yet? <clears throat> uh, lots of pertinent questions. Uh, I did not get enough sleep last night. I got adequate sleep last night. 
Man, my Friday broad... The Thursday-Friday thing is just... It's rough. <laughs> Going straight from a broadcast Thursday night to sleep to a broadcast Friday morning. I might have to figure out uh, something to do about that. But uh, so far... But I'm feeling okay. Like, I've got my coffee. I had my breakfast. I'm feeling okay. Uh, in terms of um, what I'm going to do for Monday, I haven't decided yet. <clears throat> I'm going to be making that decision this weekend, probably on Sunday. And <clears throat> I'll have be heavily taking a look at um, feedback from the last few chats and live streams uh, to make that decision. I'm kind of leaning Halo, <clears throat> but the last time I leaned Halo, I got really conflicting um, uh, feedback from the chat. Many of you were really interested, and many of you were not in any way, shape, or form interested. So... So I haven't decided. Um, I mean, there is Far Cry New Dawn, and I could do that. I mean, many people said they wanted to see Far Cry New Dawn, so maybe I'll do that. Yeah, maybe that's it. Anyway, let me know what you want, and um, I'll uh, evaluate all of the options. <clears throat> Laura says, Ox, that still doesn't beat the pile. Question, so I had to choose a Fallout-related answer, but... Yeah, the pile of babies in Outlast 2 made me stop playing Outlast 2. I saw that and I was like, yeah, I'm done. There's no need for me to explore this game and story any longer. Thanks, developers, for that. Right, let's dive in. Yes. What is it? We're in bad shape, Jacob. The attack left us in shambles, and we have no one to send to the Acropolis. I know. I'll see to the wounded here. We have to get them to someplace safe. When that's done, we'll gather anyone still able to fight. Sophia will hold them off until we can arrive. I hope to God you're right. I'll send a runner when we're ready. So we had just survived a huge assault, if you recall. Mr. Smiles Cam <clears throat> says, uh, did you know Spider-Man Remastered is coming to the PC? I did not know. Never been big on superhero games, but it's good to know that uh, fans of it are going to get a remastered version. Is there anything you need? We'll live. Maybe, but we don't have the time. How do you feel? Like a deer on a spit. Ah, it hurts to breathe. The bleeding has stopped. We'll get you medicine soon. Are you comfortable? As much as I can be. Be strong. You're going to live. Thank you. Are you sure you won't come with me? I could use your help. We lost too many here. I need to get the wounded to safety. But when we're ready, we'll be right behind you. Your people are lucky to have you. They tell me you were brave today. We had no choice, did we? You could have run. You chose to stay and fight. That is no choice at all. We are not cowards. Hmm. Can you move your feet? Good. Stay warm. Someone will see you soon. I can wait. If there are others that need that medicine more. Let us be the judge of that. Okay, um, so we need to go this way, but we missed a few things back here. A document, and a document, and a strong box. And that's because we got, um, we got jumped with a huge gunfight, so we didn't get a chance to explore. So let's go back. Let's start with this one, which I think is probably closer. And you, how are you? He looks dead. Damn. Be with God, my friend. <laughs> Damn. 
Dude comes up here like your guardian, your protective shade at your right hand. The sun shall not harm you by day, nor moon by night. The Lord guard your soul from all evil. The Lord guard your going and coming from now to all time. I mean, look at this guy. That's that. I saw this guy was dead from way over there, and he's like, "So, how are you?" <laughs> okay. Uh, let's explore. Yes. Okay. Wow, I missed more than I thought. We'll get it all, one item at a time. All right. Watch his pupils. Don't let him not off until we can look at him. Of course. Is there anything I can do? No, not now. We have to get ready to move the wounded. We found these supplies with the invaders. It's not much, but... Oh, and she gives me some bullets. Hey, cool. Uh, let's see. I should probably restock after... Um... There we go. And then I've got the shotgun. Great. Now we're not going to be wasting our resources. Yeah, there's the document. It's uh over there. Oh crap! There's a huge barricade in our way. Well, uh, oop, what was that? Hello. Hey. Wood. Yeah. Yeah, there was no way we could have looted this during the fight. So I think the game is expecting us to come back before moving on. Can we jump up there. No. Nope. All right, into the hut. Whoa! We're missing a table or something. Or these decorations, including a cigar, I think, should have been on this table over here. Uh-oh. Oh, fire hot! Fire hot! Okay, are we supposed to be using our shotgun for that? Because it's in there. How are we going to get in there? Right, well, maybe there's another way. Back the way we came.
Okay, there's something on that platform. But we don't see an option to attach rope to anything up there, so I'm presuming we don't have the kit necessary. <sighs> okay, we're going back this way. And we got all of this. Well, except for that monolith. But I don't think that our uh, ability to translate... Well, we're almost there. Let's check it out. I don't think our ability to translate has improved by enough to be able to do that. Yeah, and we're back here. There's that challenge tomb that we can't seem to find. There's the monolith. Hmm. It's some sort of marker. Byzantine script, but I can't quite make it out. Okay. And we didn't get a new campfire over here yet. So we're running back. All right. Well, the good news is that I think we got everything through here. We couldn't go that way. Uh, because of a ruined building that was blocking our path. So it looks like we didn't really miss all that much. And everything that we see over here, we're going to have to find by going this way. Okay, and we're back. That's the building we need to get into, but we can't from out here. So, let's find another way in. We explored those two buildings. Let's explore this building. Hello there. I still can't see straight. Everything's blurry. Fires still rage in the outer districts. The last of the wooden buildings will be consumed by nightfall. The heart of our city is gone, buried beneath the ice. I can take some small solace in the fact that the Mongol invaders were killed alongside the Prophet's warriors who died to save us. And the Prophet himself? No one has seen him since the morning after the siege ended. We need his wisdom. Now more than ever, we do not have enough food to feed those who survived. Some believe the worst is over, but I fear that is not the case. Ant says, Happy Friday, Oxen. Chat, Happy Friday, Ant. So good to see you. And then Robin on Facebook says, Hi, y'all. Halo, eh? Stray was good last night. <laughs> Getting a mediocre response on Halo there. Well, maybe it's going to be Far Cry New Dawn then. Uh, yeah, Stray was a lot of fun last night, and I'm glad you guys made it. That's to be expected with a blow to the head. But it, I can't say it will get better, right? But I can't promise. What do you say? I have to cut it off. I'm sorry. No! No, you can't! You're not taking my leg! You will not! 
I'm no help if I can't fight. Then you will die, do you hear me? Your leg will rot and it will kill you. Do you want that? Don't take my leg. It's going to hurt. Please. You were shot. Now, hold still. Where is your father? Why is his apprentice pulling bullets? Oh god. Let's get out of this cabin. Before the fight. I don't know now. Break action shotgun piece. All right. Hello, what's this? Is that the way I'm supposed to go? No, that looks like, uh... Okay, look at me. Er, yeah, it is the way I'm supposed to go. Rise. Let's see, what's over here? Good. Now quiet for a moment. I need to listen to your breathing. That's my only option. Oh, there's another document in here, of course. Because I'm just blind. Oh, wait, no, it's over there. Yeah, it's in that hut that we couldn't get to. Alright, so we'll go this way. Optional challenge tomb nearby. I think I know where the entrance is. New base camp discovered. All right, finally. Monolith. Here we go. Oh, now I see. It speaks of something hidden. Coin cash is revealed. And there's the challenge tomb. All right. Before we go into the challenge tomb, let's rest on up. New bow available, I Grim Whisper. From my tent, Laura. The dig looks so beautiful in the early evening, when the last embers of the sunlight dying upon a good day's work. Then, one by one, the fires are lit, and the smell of roasting meat wafts across the camp. They tell me that it's guinea pig. I declined it. Roth ate too. Maybe next time I'll bring you out here too. How did your history test go? Those were my happiest memories, Dad. Being out on the digs with you. Especially when you gave me my own little plot to excavate. I liked that. Feeling that I was part of something important. I aced that test, by the way. Okay, we've got a couple skills to upgrade. Now, stealth landing, iron hide, fire explosions. Yeah, let's try that. Oh, and that unlocks a few things. Increases timing window available for a dodge counter. Yeah, let's try that. Go to weapons. New bow available. Uh, Death's breath. Where is it? Dream stinger. Guiding light. We're still on uh, white widow. No, we were on guiding light.
Which was the new bow? Grim Whisper. This was it. A hold time goes way down. Everything else goes up. I'll try it. All right, I need more hides for that upgrade. Now we could do these. Uh, hold on, let's try my shotgun here. Oh, Harbinger. Modified full auto shotgun that announces judgment is coming. <laughs> Damage goes down, recoil stability goes down, but reload speed, ammo capacity, and rate of fire goes uh, go up. Yeah, I like it. Custom forcing cone, damage goes up. Or barrel shroud, reload speed goes up. Let's do damage. I currently have the SMG equipped. Assault rifle has greater damage, but uh, we lose out on recoil speed, reload speed, rate of fire, or re recoil ability. It just, it's so much harder. And I can't do any more upgrades, so. I mean, I've got some upgrades for the bolt action rifle. Alright, I can do a large oil flask. Now, why can't I do these yet? I'm missing more leather and cloth. Leather and cloth. Le just cloth. Right, we'll do this one. We've got the rest. We just need lots of leather and lots of cloth. We'll get there eventually. Dragon fire shells. I don't have that unlocked yet. I wonder when I learned those. Looks good. Uh, all right, so we need to explore this place. Let's see. That was the monolith. Cloth, yay. Map secrets revealed. Oh, God, lots of... Well, I'm glad we're getting all of this stuff now before we go and explore it. Alright, so there's the challenge tomb up there, but I see something down here. Hey, I got some coins out of that one, and cloth. Looks like that's it. Is that where I came from? No, that is the challenge tomb. Oh, well then what was that? Let's go find out. Oh, is that a path leading out? It is. That's our destination. Okay. I can't okay. I can't skip the challenge to him.
Got more cloth. I might actually have the cloth necessary to craft one of the upgrades by the time I finish this challenge, Tim. It's gonna be leather that's the problem. <coughs> Francis on Facebook says, New Dawn, Alice Madness Returns, or Dead Island recommended Perna character. Thank you, Francis. Love the design of this tomb. Very foreboding. Unknown area. Right, that's how we get out. Let's go deeper. Great skulls. Hmm. Some kind of burial chamber. Burial chamber or monsters or cannibals or something. Like I'm in a Sarlacc pit. A basket made of silver. Certainly meant to be decorative, but someone's been using it to carry grain. Catacombs of sacred waters. Okay, uh, can I upgrade that yet? No, I need... I need it all. Okay, let's figure this out. Ooh, what's that hiding behind the boat? Hello. Someone broke into this place in the dead of night. They filled their pockets with coin, turned over urns of oil and wine, and saw fit to show disrespect to all that are interred here. It shreds my heart to think that one of our own could be so callous as to desecrate this place, all for a momentary earthly gain. We must find a way to keep this place safe. Even from our own brothers. Hmm. A letter to the city guard speaking of a theft inside the burial chambers.
Oh, God. All right. Hit the water and die. Smashed against the rocks. Well, now we know. Interesting. for the ferryman. We may be far from our home, but that does not make us barbarians. When our loved ones pass on, as far too many have this season, we treat them with respect. When we did not yet have a vineyard to produce wine, we washed the dead with lake water. When we lacked the looms to spin the death shroud, we wrapped our departed in skins and hides. We carried few coins with us, but now we forge our own so that our blessed dead can pay passage to the next world. I only wish that the price was not so high. Hey, stealing from the dead. That's what we're doing right now. Oh, Laura. that boat. Which boat do I choose? Does it matter? God. I guess it doesn't matter. They're essentially both the same. Oh, come on! Standing on the boat, Barely have time to shoot my bow. It's not pulling it. I guess I don't understand why that one didn't work. Okay, well, there we go.
Interesting. Did they embalm their dead? Map updated! And it's showing me a few pieces in here and some stuff that we haven't even gotten to yet. A golden chalice fit for a king or a prophet. It was made here in Katash. Anatomical knowledge. Sense the location of animal hearts when using survival instincts or aiming at prey. Shots into animal hearts inflict massive damage. Animals with thick hide, bears and large cats are immune to heart shots. Press Q to activate survival instincts or hold right mouse to aim at animal to view hearts. Interesting, cool. All right, and that appears to be it. I don't see anything else around here. So we can head out. Hope they give us a quick way back. I guess uh, all of that's just for show. We can't explore that. Oh God. I don't have to interact with this one. Because this one's actually pulling us. No! I'm, I'm using it! I did not fall off! <laughs> can I climb up there? Oh my, yes I can climb out there! Oh, for Pete's sake. I'm just trying to make my life harder. That's what I do. I just make everything harder. There, there we go. Back at the beginning. <laughs> okay. Our way out.
Hennekai Kimono says, I don't remember dying that much. Oh, well, ooh, look at you. You don't remember dying that much. Oh, you're just great. Oh. I'm totally not bitter at all. No, this is, I'm fine, really. I keep seeing these things. As if I could hook to them. But I don't have the kit necessary to do so. Right. Moving forward. Wait, did we miss anything behind us? Uh, no, we got everything we could. Still no way to get down here yet. Into the Acropolis. Jacob, it's a mess up here. There's no sign of your people. Sophia might have taken them into the catacombs beneath the tower. But I've lost contact with her. All right, I'll look for her there. We're almost done evacuating the wounded here. I'll join you soon. Catacombs beneath the tower, right. Anything down here? Or is it instant death? Hey. Hello. We heard of the Prophet's arrival in Constantinople, but we paid it no mind. The great city has always drawn madmen and pretenders to the ear of God. We heard strange tales of miracles of the Prophet but still, we did not seek him out. But then we heard him speak. Heard the liquid truth of his words roll across the form of Constantine. He claimed not to speak for God. Claimed that no man could. But his wisdom was plain. And not a one of us in that form could deny that he spoke the truth. I must know more about him. I must hear him again. <clears throat> the liquid truth of his words sentence you don't hear every day. Where are we now, according to the map? Uncharted area. <coughs> Von Reck gifted five Oxhorn memberships to the chat. Congratulations to Mike Hole, Commander Shepard, Jeff Day, Matthew Silverman, and Cosmo Captain for getting those memberships. Way to go. Thank you, Von Reck. Where I can. Josh Bunton says, for those playing the drinking game on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, I advise going with water. I mean, yeah, if you were, you'd be, what, four or five shots in by now? Go with water, folks.
whom the bell tolls. You hear fighting? I hear fighting. Oh, no. Ah! I hope I'm not too late. Okay, so we've wrapped back around. Yet another base camp. I want answers, but what choice do I have now? I can't let Trinity wipe these people out. There are lines here that I crossed a long time ago, and there's no going back. I've got to help them. It's clear that Jacob's people would die for him, and he for them. That kind of loyalty is rare. And to find it here, at the ends of the earth, is truly remarkable. If I fight with them, perhaps Jacob will trust me enough to tell me what's really going on. <sighs> oh god, no. The creatures of this valley were unfamiliar to us, once. But now they are our brothers and sisters, as much as any relative of blood. You can learn much about the creatures of our valley from the hunters, but they find worth in death. We must also find the gifts our brothers give while they are still alive. In the nests of birds, you'll find feathers for the fletchers to craft arrows. Ask for what you need, and the valley will provide. Petite Captain became a bronze ox. Thank you, Petite Captain. Full auto shotgun piece. Oh, yeah. No leather? Oh man. Though I have to say I've never heard of chicken leather before. It has been months since the snows of the mountain buried the heart of Katesh. We sent men to search for survivors or food, but none have returned. Sounds drift up from the glaciers, but if people still lived entombed inside, I do not know. It could be the shifting ice, but I will be the first to admit, it sounds like the voices of men. Perhaps the ghosts of the Prophet's warriors still patrol the frozen streets. We will send no more of our people inside. We have to accept that the Prophet, and the city, are lost to us and that we are now on our own. Usually the kind of place where they like to bury something. Yeah. 
There we go. I like how there's a battle going by, and Lara Croft is just reading every book she finds. Our ancestors came here as men and women fleeing Byzantium. They wandered into a wild that almost killed them. But they survived and found this valley. And how did they honor this gift from God? By tearing the stones from the mountains and building a new empire. A mocking echo of that which almost destroyed them. But like the Tower of Babel, God saw fit to cast us down and to make us humble. We learned to listen to the land, to become stewards, not conquerors. And in turn, the land has offered up its secrets. You only have to listen. Right. Quick break, I'll be right back. Hang tight, everybody. Thank you for your patience. <sighs> it's a reliquary box. Something used to protect and hold relics of the saints. Anything from teeth to fingers to the entire head, this claims to be a relic of the prophet. empty.
them out. Don't shoot. We will... Oh my god. Missed one. Be more. Just murderized all these poor people. Rancid Hamster says, Hello, Ox and Chat. What's the difference between enzyme and hormone? You can't hear an enzyme. Lol. Happy Friday. That was a dirty one, Rancid Hamster. Dirty. Dirty, dirty, dirty. Leather. I got a skill point from all that. Okay, I don't think I'm leaving anything behind. Hey, check this out. You're dead. Can't read any of these uh ball pens. Engineer! Now! Drop it! Drop the gun! Don't shoot! We need to fire! <laughs> Under fire! Under fire! Murdering everyone they see.
lots of salvage. See, did I miss anything? No, it doesn't look that way. Ruins are absolutely sprawling. Goodness. Really? There's no lore or coins or anything over here? I've been here. Did I backtrack? I backtracked. Bastards are resourceful. They might have set up some traps. Don't worry. I'll kill anything that moves. Just take it slow. Stay sharp. Hang on. Right there. went back because I didn't get a chance to fully loot it. I prefer this. Questions just get in the way.
Untie me. I'll kill every last one of them. Easy, Sophia. So much bloodshed. We're losing too many people. Maybe your people have sacrificed enough. It's... all we've known. I misjudged you, Lara. Tell me how I can help you. I've got to get the rest to safety. But the entrance of the catacombs is blocked. I'll find a way to clear it. You're gonna be okay. Kunk says, did you hear Russia grumbling about taking back Alaska? Right. Followed right. Anchorage, here we come. Resource wars safety. seem more likely every day. Keep up the good work. Thanks, I did hear that, and I laughed. I think as much as everyone in the world laughed when I said that. We'll get you We need to get these wounded to safety. Oh, hello. It's barred from the other side. Lara, we've got to find a way past the blockage. Mushrooms grow everywhere. Right. This mural shows the moment they found the valley. It must have looked like a paradise. There it is. Maybe I can unblock it from here. The catacombs. We'll be safe there. <laughs> and that grenade didn't hurt any of them. I love Thank that. You, They'll be safe in the catacombs for now. I know you seek the divine source, but my people will die to protect it. Your people are already dying. You can't protect it forever. We've lasted this long. But for now, I'm glad to have you as an ally. They're converging on the tower. We still got people there. Get the others to safety. They'll need you. New gear unlocked a grenade arrow. Oh yeah, crafting grenade arrows. Use the inventory menu to craft grenade arrows. Okay. Oh, I'm using up all of my cloth. I'm gonna save my cloth for upgrades. All right, that's the door that we unlocked. <clears throat> that's the room we got through. Where's the wall we battered down? Oh no, that's the room we came through. Okay. Yep, glad I came back. An ancient deer charm carved from a stag's antler. It could have been an important object or a child's toy. <laughs> Funny how you can't tell the difference. Right. 
I can read this now. And it's pointing somewhere. Coin caches. Oh, did I miss a coin cache? Yeah. Okay, pathway over there. Um, that's the way I need to go, but there's a campsite over here. Let's use that real quick. My father is missing. Last night, I told him of the invaders and the weapons they have at their disposal. When the sun rose, he was gone. Cyril told me he would be back, but the day is almost done and no one has seen him. I fear he may have done something rash, the old fool. We need him. At this moment, more than ever. Brawler's been coming in handy. <clears throat> Dodge counter. Let's get that. Let's go to my inventory upgrades. Still no? What? I'm still missing leather. This is what happens when I don't stop the action in the game and stop the story to go hunt for mindless leather. Or to mindlessly hunt for leather, rather. Requires leather. Requires leather. There we go. Extended magazine. Lubricated well. What outfit do I have on Huntress? Reduces the delay. I don't need that one. Wait, that's not what I have on. I have a uh, Siberian Ranger. Yeah, this is the one I want. The flora of our valley from the tall trees to the lowly mushrooms, were foreign to our ancestors when they first arrived. It took time and tragedy to learn the language of this land. But now we pass on this knowledge with every generation. The earth offers all we need. There is the healing herb, which you know to seek near sources of water and in sheltered coves. The birchwood of the forest, straight and true, can be gathered to make arrows. And the death caps, the mushrooms you find inside rotting logs or in dark, damp places can make a potent poison. Okay, I just found some cigars. I thought I was out, but I found a tidy little stash that I hid from myself. I'm going to try and get these cut real quick. My desktop cigar cutter is jammed.
There we go. Sorry about that. Had that desktop cigar cutter for years. And it chooses now while I'm live on camera to jam. Thankfully, I've got this nice little backup. And there we go. The show may continue. to me. I can do this. A papal bull. The lead seal marking the authenticity of a document. This must have been attached to something of great import, like a writ of excommunication. Mega Glow Z says, okay, I couldn't stand it anymore and I had to look. Chicken. <laughs> he says, chicken leather from legs is used for making luxury items like fine gloves and wallets. Who knew? Really? So those of us, uh, uh, of us with leather wallets might be walking around with a pocket full of chicken leather and we didn't even know it. What do you know? So... <laughs> Survivor from the old era says, So what cigars did past you not want current you to find? So I, uh, the, I'll, I'll raise the veil a little bit behind the whole Oxhorn production here. Um, I work best when I have a cigar in my hand. I, you know, when I'm doing a lore video or when I'm doing a live stream, I can focus. When I don't have one, I get distracted easily. So, you know, I got to stay focused and... Uh, I don't time things correctly. You know, I've got my humidor full of cigars and I take one by one by one. And usually I don't resupply, order a new shipment until, you know, it's really, really low. And sometimes shipping can take a day or two. Or if I order on a Friday or a Saturday, I got to wait through the weekend. And, and, you know, I'm I'm out up a certain creek without a certain paddle um, cigar wise. So sometimes what I'll do is I'll hide some from myself so that as the humidor gets low, I'll order it a little bit late and then I'm completely out. But then I remember my stash and I'm like, oh yeah, I hid some to last myself the weekend for the box to arrive. And that's what I did. I, while, the, while we were reading one of those documents, I was pilfering the back end of my humidor to find some cigars and I found two. I found two. This should last me through the broadcast. <laughs> Over here, we need your help. Did I miss any red barrels there?
new gear acquired enhancement tool. Upgrade tool that unlocks an additional tier of all weapon upgrades. Oh, great. Try out these explosive arrows. That was the right one, right? Huh. I guess, uh, it only works on people. Chad is saying they can hear clicking sounds. And now it's gone, says the chat. Huh. Trying to figure out if maybe I had a microphone that turned on randomly, but I don't. I don't have another microphone than this one. Weird. Making sure I'm not missing any loot along the way, and I don't think so. Lots of grenades.
Okay. Object cannot be used when enemies are nearby. Unsafe. Jacob, it looks like we've got the upper hand. Good work. Those choppers should be in range soon. We did it. Laura, are you there? Trinity is swarming the tower. We're trapped in the catacombs beneath. Damn! Just hold on! I'm on my way! Okay, now can I loot all this stuff over here? Elias and I will attempt to reach the far hills, where the old bear lives. Trinity is still clustered below in the old Soviet base. We will wait until the dead of night to go. It is a great risk, but we know a battle is coming. We'll have need of the medicinal herbs that grow in those hills, if we are to survive the coming struggle. Right, new campsite. I haven't gotten the leather necessary to do any of these upgrades. But I unlocked a new tier here. Hair trigger increases rate of fire. Muzzle brake increases recoil stability. I can't afford the rest. weapon equipped. It is our first winter since the Mongol invasion. No more than one in three of us will survive. We once had marble palaces, heated by geothermal vents. We had the wealth and luxury of an empire. Today, we struggle to find enough hides to keep our children warm, to gather enough roots and berries to feed ourselves. If we are to survive another winter, we will have to adapt. If we do not, then we will feed the soil, and the animals will take back the valley. It is up to us now. Only us. Monster? Did I hear some sort of crazy monster? This is 
Machine 5, we're heading into the catacombs. Need some back up here. Got it. On our way. We're losing! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Jacob, they're gone. I fear this battle is far from over. Will you tell me more about this place? You've earned that much. Come with me. What was that thing that was roaring? That's what I want to know. Great shot. In ancient times, our prophet brought the divine source to this valley. My ancestors built a test to protect it from the outside world. To what end? What is the divine source, Jacob? artifact from a time long forgotten. We believe it holds a fragment of God's soul. Legend tells us those who beheld the source were granted immortality. But others have always been drawn here, seeking its power. Trinity. Yes. They seek to spread their darkness across the world. With the source, their soldiers would be unstoppable. Then help me find it before they do. This is not your burden. Of course it is. My father died for this. You can't fill the emptiness inside you, Lara. You can only set it free. Set free the emptiness. I'm gonna find it. With or without you. Wait, Sophia, let me go. I have to do what I can. You spilt blood for us. I want to help. You know where the Atlas is? The cathedral, in the archives below. But we won't follow you there. Why? What will I find? There are others. Others? The deathless ones. Uh-oh. They will kill any who trespass. My father believes they will stop Trinity. You can't take that chance. I know. Here. Take this. It will help you reach the cathedral. Okay. Find a safe path back to the Remnant Village. Oh, where even am I? All right, so that's the path back. Oh, we missed some stuff because we were so busy in that huge firefight. Let's go back and loot what we can. If we can. What? How 
How did we get here? Come on! How did we get here? You you hit me with an uninterruptible cutscene immediately after a battle, with that, robbing me of the opportunity to finish looting this place. Ah, oh, come on. Oh, now we get to learn what these are. The grapple axe. While in the air, press E to deploy the grapple axe. Uh, leap of faith? What even is this? Wow, wow. Okay. Grapple axe. But of course, they put loot down here. <sighs> Map secrets revealed. So angry. I just have this rage. You make loot? But then I cannot loot, loot, rage! Grapple to ledge. Throw your grapple axe while jumping to reach for ledges. Oh, dear God. Right. It even works on rock faces. Yes. I wonder if I'm missing anything for not going that way. There is something up there. Can I jump up there? Just ignore whatever that was up there. <sighs> Something up there. Julian Z says, Ox, don't rage just yet. You can fast travel back at the next base camp. You'll get your loot soon. Thank you, Julian. Grapple axe, two axe walls, okay.
Lara, if you're headed to the cathedral, Trinity will be everywhere. I know, but I have no choice. Silent Night, sneak or fight through the occupied village. I think you know which one I'm gonna end up doing. Break action shotgun piece, hey -o. So much violence and death. Jacob's people have been through so much, yet they continue to fight. They are bound by an oath taken by their ancestors, a duty handed down from the past. But I see a people who simply want to live in peace. I believe it's time for them to let go of the past. If I can find the Atlas, it might lead to the Divine Source. I could take it away from here. They wouldn't have to suffer anymore. They could share the burden of the truth with the world. But if all this leads to nothing, I don't know what I'll do. Dodge Kill Mastery, Stealth Landing. Dodge Kill Mastery. I got a break action shotgun piece, but I don't have any resources necessary. I need more scrap now. Oh yeah, I saw that loot. Thought I was gonna miss it, nope. We have a true test now, young ones. The valley is balance. When one thing slides, it affects all others. The fire two harvests ago led to an unusual bloom of berries. That led to more deer. And now, we've got too many damned wolves. They're not good eating, but to keep the valley in harmony, we're tracking wolves tonight. They come out after dark and roam the whole valley, but we're going to track them to their dens in caves and other underground places. Stay close together. When you hunt wolves, the wolves are just as likely to hunt you. Hmm. Can I use the shotgun for this? Nope, that's wooden barriers. So how do I do this without blowing myself up? I can't. <laughs> Heavy pistol part, all right. I can no longer deny the pull that Alia has on me. She came to me, alone, as I walk the passes high above the valley. 
I know now that the draw was mutual. I explained to her why I could not, should not, why my position amongst our people should preclude such folly, why I could never make her happy. But it didn't matter what I said. As my mouth spoke, my arms reached out to enfold her, and we embraced. It has been so long, and I am still human. Bye. 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 <laughs> Bye. You hang up first. You hang up first. You can't? Okay, bye. My daughter decided to FaceTime me. <clears throat> She's on her iPad in the other room. She decided to FaceTime me in the middle of a stream. She knew I was on the stream. She just wanted to say hi. Okay. Uh, where was I? I kind of think there's something up there. There's a chest up there. <laughs> Whoa, well, that was messy. What? <laughs> Come on. God. All right, there's a uh, a cache, a survival cache of, over there too. On the ground, oh man. Can I grapple to that? Did I get it? No. Yeah. Okay, back up. Most of the wounded to safety, but the invaders returned. They've taken the upper village. There are more of us down in the valley, organizing for our resistance. We'll take any extra hands we can get. If you're going back to the village, be careful. Greetings. <clears throat> well, that is the way we're going, but during the zip line, I saw some stuff that was missed. I wonder if I can go back this way. We haven't explored down there yet because it was blocked off to us. From the opposite direction. So...
wanted to get in this house, though. Okay, this is taking us the wrong way, but hey, we can go back for this monolith and that coin cache. But if I'm reading this right... One cache is revealed! Let's get that one. cleared that one, so I don't know why I keep getting a notification about an optional challenge tomb. There's a coin cache over there, but I really don't want to backtrack all the way just yet. Let's keep going. <clears throat> I'm sure we'll find an opportunity to come back for all those things we missed in a bit. Still can't get in there. Just the ones they think might know something about the Atlas. Constantine's gonna ask them a few questions. They've got the rest back up near the cathedral. Hmm. Someone's gonna have some fun. That must be them. I was hoping they'd draw straws for that job. Oh well. How long you been on the payroll? A few months. This is my first web work assignment. Huh? I see her! Take her down! He's gone! Fire. Uh. Just you and me. Uh. Silent night, my butt! Lots of uh, ways I could have done this. Leaping up on stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All very fancy. Who 
what's the point of this? Would I have been able to stealth by unnoticed this way? I guess. Ooh, I see something sparkling. Sparkle, sparkle. Attached to everything I've learned so far. Anna and Constantine, they're in charge out here, but someone else is pulling the strings above them. Someone with a lot of cash and the means to move it around. I've narrowed down the source, but I'm having a hard time believing someone in the Vatican is running a private army. But all roads lead to Rome. Trust me, this sounds crazy even to me, but people have to know this. If I'm gonna die for this, I want to be on the right side for once. And Constantine, I know you're probably reading this too. You might make me disappear, but you won't win out here. And if I never get the chance to say it to your face, you're out of your fucking mind. But it's an audio recording. What do you mean, read this? Okay. Okay, so to continue, I gotta go over? Oh, right. That was a lot of them. We'll try again. I mean, who needs stealth, right? I just need to reload a save if I die. Keep trying again. Come on, I don't want that. I want to use the fuel pump. All right. Mm. 
money. Action shotgun piece. It's over there. I have sinned in God's name. Much blood has been spilled on this valley floor. As I speak now, blood continues to flow. Forgive me. That the divine work requires sacrifices does not mean I am clean. Forgive me, for since I've suffered the stigmata in my youth, I've sinned in your name. Forgive those I've killed myself and those who've been killed in my name. They knew not what they were doing. Forgive me. Forgive me for the work I do is not yet done. And there is yet much blood to be spilled. that you are hunters every last one of you and I am proud your final lesson comes today a test all hunters must face today we'll track the one thing bigger and meaner than me in this valley Today, we'll take down a bear. We only hunt bears when they get old and ornery when they start to enter the village. And now, we have such a bear. I've tracked him to his den, watching him range across the valley, following the other animals. We must throw our spears together. When he rears up, aim straight and true for his heart. A lucky shot between the ribs can drop any beast. Pray you make it, because there won't be a second chance. Well, I doubt I'm going to be able to get a lucky shot to the heart. That looks like a bear cave. I thought I could burn... What? What is the point of this? Okay, fine. Security guards came at night. I knew they would. I crossed a line when I killed the tech from Echo Squad. I knew I shouldn't have, but I couldn't help it. Remnant weren't enough. I needed something 
more. They brought me to the windowless room. I thought I was dead. And then Constantine was there. He took my head in his hands and smiled. He told me he understood. He was like me once. I've sinned, but there could be forgiveness. <laughs> I have been a blunt instrument, swinging wildly. He told me I could be redeemed. I've got a special skill. I just need sharpening. Trinity can make me a weapon, point me in the right direction. I almost cried and kissed his feet. I will become what I was meant to be for Trinity, for Constantine. Oh, right. I was pressing the wrong button for fire arrows. Fire arrow, middle mouse button. There we go. So a bear. No. Oh. Just loot. For a month I have gone to the forum to hear the prophet speak. I wear robes of the common folk. It would not do for a son of a great house to be seen here. There are rumblings that the patricians and men from the church in the west seek to silence the prophet. I can only listen and reproduce the great man's words. No man has ever told the truth about God, for no man can ever know. There is more sacred in the heart of a farmer or a soldier than in the hearts of lords and emperors. We are all of us deceived by those that claim to speak on behalf of the Creator. No man speaks for him, for his voice in the sky, the water, and the flow of the world. You know, we're hearing a lot from people who have heard the prophet's words and they've been touched by them, but we haven't really heard any of those amazing words of the prophet at all. I can't get to that one. It's on the other side. There's salvage over there? Did I miss out on salvage? Can't miss out on salvage. Hey. Okay. not his call, but he's going to put a recommendation in for us both. Then there'll be an initiation ceremony of some sort. Deacon? So that's it? That's all he can do? Look, some of those guys were on contract for years before Trinity gave him rank. Deacon! You have to be patient. There's more to it than performance. Like what? There's some sort of oath and then the ceremony. He said we'd find out soon enough. Attack! 
That's totally Deacon, says Courtney Zayas. Yeah. Man, I was distracted by finding Deacon in this game. So what did he say? It's not his call, but he's going to put a recommendation in for us both. <laughs> got incoming! There we go. Hear that? What was that? It's a weird noise. Croft is operating against us at every turn. Someone put a fire in her. Lord Croft was too bookish to possess any true resolve. He was a coward. His daughter is something different. I almost gave an order today that no man should kill Croft but me. I fear she is starting to cloud my judgment. I must remind myself, the goal is not another dead Croft. The goal is the divine source. Lots of radios. No. Maps on the table. And a staircase leading upstairs.
fucking illness. It's ruining my body. Now it threatens my mind as well. I keep drifting off. Getting lost in memories. Lost in thoughts of the day Lord Croft died. How the plan had to shift. How I thought we had failed. And before that, my early days with Trinity. Learning the secret histories of the world, learning that it was our duty to save it. And back farther, to childhood. Constantine and I, with childhood friends? Only each other to rely on. And then I rip myself free, back to the present. I've always done what had to be done. And this time will be no different. Okay. <clears throat> I still need to find a way to get that survival cache. I feel like I've passed it. Let's go get it. I know that's the way forward, but... Way up there? Okay, so it's just on the other side of this. I must have missed it while I was exploring this camp over here. over there okay but there's no other outlet so I gotta figure out a way over there and then there's that how do I get to the other side of this Is it really worth it? One survival cache. Am I going to make myself go crazy because I can't get this one survival cache? I'm not going to worry about it. It's one survival cache, and uh, it's not apparent how I get over there. Destroy the glowing barrels? I mean, I tried. I could try with an explosive. Not working. Like, I just don't understand it.
Right. Von Rex says you need to throw pumpkins into the barrels. Oh, is that some challenge here? I haven't even seen pumpkins. All right. Grapple to the ledge. Ah, oh, let's see. So this overlooks where I was. Okay, so we've got a wall over there, a wall over there. I underestimated our enemy. Elias is now dead because of my fool's errand, and my father has not been seen in two days. We would need to be at our full strength to resist Trinity, but it seems the killing blow was dealt before the fight even began. We have the armor of our faith, but what good is it against an enemy that grows stronger with every passing generation? If we survive this time, I fear our children will not survive the next. Campfire. New skill points. Napalm arrows. Upgrade fire arrows to increase range of fire. Death cloud arrows. Cluster bomb arrows. Demolitions expert. Dragon fire shells. Craft incendiary shotgun shells that wreak havoc by lighting enemies on fire and igniting other flammable objects. Yes. Okay, a couple of upgrades I can afford. Wider barrel diameter means more shot can be loaded for increased damage. Faster fire rate. Ammo capacity. Reload speed. Let's do damage. Extended magazine. Large drum magazine. And that's all I can afford right now. Okay, so there's something in a house behind me. Way up there. All right, I'll be getting there in a minute. Now let's explore this area. Itself. Damn. Exotic animal skin full, of course. Leather, finally. All right, I could leap up there. There's lore over there. Taking the long way. A thin, fluted flint arrowhead snapped in two. Hmm, the base is familiar. 
base is similar to arrowheads found in America. The technique survived migration halfway around the world. Sweeping the lower valley. Do you have eyes on them? Negative. Possible hostiles? Could just be radio interference, but Constantine's not taking chances. Almost died there. Some believe the Prophet to be God's son risen, but he makes no such claims. Some praise his actions as miracles, but he rejects such attributions. In his humility, his followers see the truth of his message. We see the change coming. I have shed the trappings of my station and now devote myself fully to the Prophet. I spread his word, recruiting others of my station to the cause. But this has enraged the elite, and brought the full attention of the church in the West. Hmm. Okay, so that was the base camp I was at. Probably should have left them, let them keep talking, but I didn't want them to, uh, you know, find me. Body go, it must have fallen. Ooh, hello. That's where I need to go. There's some scrap over there, but what's up there?
Right. The cathedral. Find a way into the cathedral. Flooded archives. Okay. Well, there's the big bell. What was causing the gong that we heard earlier? If it's ruined. Had to go down. Okay, try again. There we go. There's another bell. That must be what we heard. Okay. Oh dear. Kill an unarmed woman? That would be cold even for you, Lara. Then again, I know why you haven't pulled that trigger. Shoot me and my men will cut you down within seconds. It's the one thing they're better at than you. Shut up, Anna. Below the floor. Oh, how, how'd she Don't get all caught up? You have nowhere to go. Down. Kill her now. Here we go. Ooh. <laughs> Crap! I accidentally skipped that cutscene. Sorry, everybody. What happened to Anna? Uh, somehow she survived, I guess? Damn, I'm sorry, everybody. Croft continues to create difficulties for us. She's rallied the Valley people from their squalid huts and helped lead them to a series of victories. I wish I could make her understand just how wrong she is. How misguided her ideas of morality are. The world is too flawed for stopgaps. 
A lone hero cannot rescue it. The idea of revealing the Divine Source to the world would be laughable if it wasn't so dangerous. Did I think she could be turned to Trinity's side before? Yes. But not anymore. We were close, she and I. There is a bond there, but... I think now there is no other choice. She must be broken. And I know she can be broken. I've broken stronger than her. Relito says, nah, she's gone. I mean, maybe, but she's kind of a huge villain in this game. If she did drop down that huge chasm, I doubt she's dead. I'm sure we'll see her again. Atlas, find a way down into the archives. I'm ahead of Anna now, but I don't know what I've gotten myself into here. Something else dwells in the darkness of this place. Yeah, we heard it. But I've got to continue. I've come too far. Anna thinks she knows me. And maybe she does on some level, but she doesn't know everything. And as long as she continues to underestimate me... I might still have the upper hand. I don't think I have enough scrap to upgrade any further. Oh, what do you know? Hey, look at that. Shooting glove. Do it so I don't waste those anymore. Singeferno says, Ox, you should jump down just to see if it's survivable. Okay. An old mural. And those vessels. Greek fire. The prophet's deathless army. Armed with Greek fire. They were unstoppable. Yeah, but no one uh, knows the recipe to Greek fire. It was lost. Came through there. No, I'm not gonna go commit suicide. Thank you, Cinch Burnoff. It's like a Skyrim tomb. Uh, that smell. Oh no. Burned alive. By whom? We came late for the barbecue. Oh, God. Let me, please, let me go. Let me go. Stealth kill. Who could have done this? What the hell is that? What? Oh dear. These vessels, they're still filled with Greek fire. I wonder if it will still burn. Oh my god, but we've lost the recipe for Greek fire. As, the, as an archaeologist, she sh should be asking, hey, can we save this, take a sample back to a lab, and, you know, try and figure out what's in it? But no. She's like, hmm, I wonder if we can explode it. <laughs> the Wandering Exile says, well, that's one way of helping him. Hey, he was beyond help. The skin on his face had been singed off. He was in agony. We put him out of his misery. The church in the West has sent their messengers, self-proclaimed soldiers of God, 
the Knights of the Order of Trinity. They have come to silence the Prophet, to quell his blasphemy and eradicate our movement. But it is too late now. We will not be silenced. Violence erupts in the Forum on a daily basis. The Prophet knows that we cannot stand against them, so we must leave Constantinople. We will go to the desert to build anew and continue the Prophet's work. Lots of barrels of Greek fire. Oh, all right. Of course, I jump right down into the chasm. Emperor died, the Prophet's favor was lost, and we were forced to begin our exodus in the dark of night. The new Emperor has no love for the Prophet, so there was nothing left to stop the Knights of the Order of Trinity. We fled towards the desert, to begin again, when the Order of Trinity came upon us, and murdered the Prophet. I saw him die. We placed his body in a cave near the oasis and in our sorrow, began to build him a tomb. The Order of Trinity is not finished. They desire not only the death of the Prophet, but the mysteries of the Divine Source. They will come again. But in our darkest hour, the Prophet has risen. He has defeated death, just as he will defeat our enemies. Julian Z says, Ox, wait, are you saying that in real life we don't know the recipe for Greek fire? When and where was it lost? Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. I got a coffee just in time. Uh, yes, uh, so I don't know the names or the dates, but I remember... Uh, that uh, the only reason we know about Greek fire is, is because it was described by an ancient historian who was talking about a battle that the Greeks were waging against either the Persians or themselves. And the battle was a decisive victory for the Greeks because they employed something known as Greek fire. And in the historical records, they described how it worked, but they didn't list the recipe. And um, people have been trying to replicate a fluid, a flammable fluid that works the way Greek fire did, the way it was described to have worked. And uh, no one has been able to replicate those exact characteristics of Greek fire. So yes, we have a lot of, you know, modern uh, in, you know, flammable things that are great, but the exact recipe of Greek fire has been lost to history and we can't replicate it. And then um, Rabino says Greek fire is volatile to transport, so even if she was that kind of archaeologist, she knows of no current way of doing so and still, uh, and still live. But all of the Greek fire we find in this temple is already in barrels for transport, right? It had to have been moved into that temple somehow and likely in the barrels that we find them in. It wasn't created in the barrel. It was created somewhere else, put in the barrel, and then brought into the temple. So clearly it can be moved. And she's got a canteen. I'm sure she could have dunked a canteen in, saved a bit of Greek fire to uh, analyze it later in a lab. But now she just blows it up. All right, we came from there. Lots of Greek fire around here.
The Atlas. What's that noise? That's a lot of burning fire. What is that? Zero visibility, oh my god. Jeez. Freddie Simmons says, there's someone I, I, I've noticed about the mooks Lara goes up against. They're extremely inept. They have very slow reaction time and they are not very attentive right now. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure there's a harder difficulty. <laughs> but I'm playing on a normal difficulty, so... Wait, no, I, I changed it to hard, didn't I? What difficulty am I playing on? Uh, Seasoned Raider. I'm playing on Seasoned Raider. So that's normal difficulty? Aim assistance is disabled. So there are two levels of difficulty above this one. Survivor and Extreme Survivor.
Oh no. Sulfur. This whole place could go up. Got to hurry. Uh... Should we be using Greek fire in a place filled with sulfur? Here! I fucking got it! Dude didn't uh, mind where he dropped the body, so. Ooh, a rebreather. Hey. Wasn't there a cave we couldn't explore because we didn't have the rebreather? The rebreather allows Laura to stay submerged underwater indefinitely without taking damage. Alright. That guy was equipped with everything. I think I see my exit. The statue's unstable. Looks like I'll have to use the wind fire. Okay. Right, yeah, I get the picture. We're gonna use the Greek fire. Sounds good. Got to be more Greek fire vessels I can use. Just got to find them. Alright, so move all of the Greek fire vessels over there. Fine. The point of that Still was more to do here. I'll be back this way. Okay. <laughs> what were you saying about Greek more fire being Greek unstable? Fire vessels. So many of them. I mean, it seems Looks pretty like stable to me. Prepared for war. They must have been put into storage here, but these containers are broken. More Greek fire vessels. Got to get it across the mouth. Two will do, Ox. Thank you, Rulito. I'm just exploring for loot right now. More Greek fire vessels. Got to get it across the mountain. Oh my god, will you shut up?
push it anymore? Why can't I push it anymore? is intact it should still spin yeah I figured that out uh, but I need to find out how to spin it mm, there's still more to do here I'll be back this way mm, there's still more to do here just I'll be back this Laura, way for crying out loud mm, there's still more to do here I'll be back this way There's still more to do here. I'll be back this way. right to it. Okay, is that going to be enough? Or should I get the other one over too? I think that's enough. They're, they're not going to make me do it twice. Only one thing left to do. Yeah, they're not going to make me do it twice. One more support left. All right, so the one on the far end, we get to, we get to do it all over again on the far end. What's this? Well, oh, that's what I came out of. Right. Steel 101 says uh, Laura's a bit of a chatterbox today, isn't she? Yeah, they really don't want us to miss how to do this puzzle. Find a campfire. I got a skill point. Increases man-made crafting resources. Fully charged bow. Triple shot. Napalm arrows. All right, one more support over on that side. Is it the same puzzle?
do we have to clear the way again? I don't think I've cracked this yet. I'll have to come back. If I could use the water somehow. Wow. Pyro says, uh, <clears throat> you loved Red Dead Redemption 2. You should consider Grand Theft Auto, the best rated and best selling game games in history. Or maybe Mafia. Not as good as Grand Theft Auto, but it takes place in the 1930s. Maybe I have been considering Mafia at least. So, we need to direct the, the barrel down this other path. Because if it goes there, it ignites on fire. So... I see. There we go. And we've got a ramp. But they force us into a cutscene. <laughs> Lame, oh, I wanted to explore back there. Jump left. anything behind well nothing that was marked on the map anyway 
There was an entire room up there that I didn't explore, because I thought I could uh, finish exploring Jacob, before I walk up the ramp. I made it. I'm out. Lara. Ah, thank God you're all right. Bring the Atlas to me in our observatory in the mountains. I'm on my way. And I, Kimono says, I mean, you jumped left. I uh, no, 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 no. I did not jump left. I was pressing up when I pressed jump, and she, on her own, jumped left. That's what I'm saying. That's what happened. I'm not gonna argue about it. It was her. Her fault. That's it. Mr. Virus says, a master doesn't blame the tools. Oh, <laughs> Mr. Virus. But when did I ever claim to be a master? I'm, uh, I'm an advanced journeyman, right? That's what I am. Just an advanced journeyman. Nana Gen K4 says, you missed a bunch in there and we'll have to go back for sure. Oh, man. Yeah. Probably right. Full auto shotgun piece. Yes. This commemorates the construction of a great city. Kitesh. Laura! Laura, are you up there? Jonah, is that you? <laughs> wow, long time no here. My little bird! You're alive! I knew it! My god! Jonah, what are you doing here? Where are you? I'm up here in some kind of fortress. You can thank Jacob. His people picked me up half dead out on the tundra. I can't believe you came after me. <laughs> Is that so hard to believe? I told you I got your back. I couldn't leave you out here alone. I'm on my way up to you now. Don't go anywhere. She sounds pissed off. I hadn't planned on it. Be <laughs> careful out there. He comes out here to help, and now she's like, oh, great, another person I'm going to have to keep alive. Steel 101 says, oh, yeah, it's always the keyboard's fault. I mean, I, I made this keyboard. I built it. It's not its fault. It's perfect. Neither is it the fault of the hands using the keyboard. No, it's Laura's fault. <sighs> it's all her fault. Oh, and we're back. Hello. Oh. So is this that tomb? Yes, it is. Lara, glad to see you're still with us. The invaders are spread all over the valley, but we're pushing back where we can. If you can lend a hand, you're always welcome. We know we can trust you. Well, that's good. But do I have time for an optional challenge, tomb? I think so.
Doesn't look like there's... Oh, there is something up there. There's a note up there. God, why is this so difficult? Oh, there we go. There's a woman in the valley now. Not one of us, but not one of them either. I saw her the night Elias was killed. She fought the men who were hunting us. Now I hear whispers from the forward scouts. My father and this woman were seen, free and unhindered. There's no telling what she wants or if I can trust her. But if she brings my father back, then perhaps God has not abandoned us. Okay. Optional challenge to him. I remember this. The hilt of an ancient dagger. Blades gone, but it's a femur of some sort. Almost certainly human. Perhaps it's some sort of ritual object. Hey. Okay, what have I missed? Oh, there's a lot over here, and I bypassed the challenge tomb again. How did I pass that up? Oh, well, that's where I need to go. Up there. Hold on. Let's get the loot. Someone else was attacking Trinity in the darkness beneath the cathedral. Could it be the Deathless One Sophia spoke of? And if so, what part do they have to play in all of this? I have so many questions. But for now, I'm just relieved. Jonah's alive. I should have known he'd come looking for me. And thank God Jacob's people found him before he ran afoul of Trinity. I never wanted him to follow me into danger. Barrel Shroud. Custom handle wrapping allows for almost instant prying of doors and strong boxes. I'll spend it on the Barrel Shroud. Okay. Survival cache. There. Survival cache. Coin cache. There. Survival cache. 
there. Path forward for the quest, but challenge freaking tomb. If it's way down there. It's one of those that I needed the rebreather for. Well, I do have a, a campfire. I could zap back up here at any point. So, uh, we can go down and try to get it. Alley up. Lara, I'd like to examine the Atlas of the I've got it here. I'm on my way soon. Just keep it safe until then. We'll be waiting. There was also a document. Let's go get the document first. Up there. Now we can grapple to it. I think. How can we not grapple to that? Where's the challenge tomb? Am I going into the right spot? Yeah, I needed the rebreather. Z says, Ox, wasn't there something under the waterfall too? Yeah, now that you mention it, I think there was a cave under there. Oh, great. EG says it wouldn't be Oxhorn if he didn't loot. Three hours late to the stream, but hope you and the chat are doing great. Thank you, EG. We're doing amazing here. Glad you came. New base camp, Whirlpool Sanctuary. A scroll case inlaid with ivory and gems. Interesting. It's been altered with this rough strap of leather and it's been used to store plants. Ooh, pressure plate. I think I'll skip that. That'd be a fun death. It pushed me onto it. 
I was walking through here. I was walking through here and it pushed me onto it. I'm not even kidding. I know how to use a keyboard, people. I know how to use one. Ah! An ivory jar. It looks like it was carved from a single tusk. A simple thing, but the level of detail in the carving is impressive. It's so cheap. Why did they do that to me? That's gonna be our way out. Courtney Zayas says, of course it did, it did! <laughs> Why don't you believe me? <laughs> the dead choke the rivers. Our children's blood is spilled on the valley floor. We live, but with what? Our city entombed? Our sons and daughters murdered? Is it courage to go on? Or madness? Those who fell no peace now. When will we? All right. Hmm, that's a lot of foliage. Lucky root placement there. Oh, the bats of Kitesh. Oh, God. I guess we take a plunge. Flooded deliberately. Right, there's a beam over there, a beam over there, some sort of contraption, and a beam over there. Lots of places for us to swim. Oh, this is gonna be fun. We cannot leave our children to rot beneath the sun. But there are too many graves to dig, and the earth is hard. What need have we for leisure now? This place, like so many others, will never ring with laughter again. We have made the whole world a tomb. The dead shall rest. We owe them that much. Mila says that looks like blood. Yeah, it's, it's really red water. Perhaps it's rust? Rusty water from iron in the soil or something leaching out. I don't know. But you're right, it's weird. Oh, this just brings us back here. Okay. Um, well. Can't aim a bow from up here. So many dead. What happened here? No sign of other violence. Map updated. Uh, and it's not showing me any other secrets, which means I think I got most of the ones in here. Or maybe it's doing so now. Yep, nope, still none. So we could... Do that. But we're not next to anything that we can put it to. Why can't I dive low enough to go in there? See that hole down there? I can't dive deep enough to get in there. Right. And there's another hole there, but I can't dive any deeper than this way to get in there. Okay, so we've got this.
So now we've got a boat, but we're still... It came undone. I see. Okay, and then that locks it in place, I'm assuming? Okay. Water no longer rising. Great. Ooh! Oh, we got bodies in the water! Oh! No! Oh, jeez. That's a dead end. Now we can swim in here. Brings it down even more. The grass must be floating. Okay, but what do we latch it to? I don't see anything where we could latch it to something. 
This is the room we tried to get into earlier. I mean, we could latch it to the boat, I suppose. <clears throat> Julian Z says, Ox, is that why the water is this color? Yeah, but two bodies? It's only two bodies. Oh, I see. We bring the boat in, and then that wooden barricade is going to keep it. Gotcha. Okay. out for burial. A mass grave. Julian Z says, Ox, but don't you remember the note you read in here? They had no place to bury all their dead, so they decided to put them in here alive? Or they decided to put them all in here? Yeah, yeah, you're right. And she just confirmed that by saying mass grave. That's what this is, and that's why the water is so red. Okay, well, that's our path up. Let's see. Any loot? Manual for mountaineering. 
New skill mastered, Iron Grip. Climbing on rock and ice surfaces is slightly faster. <laughs> nice. Tomb Raided, the Baths of Kitesh. I think that's it. Yep, nothing else in here. Let's see, we went down there, we went down there. Did we go down here to see if there were any coins? I think we did. And we went down here to see if there were any coins. I think we did. All right, up we go. a few minutes left in the broadcast and so this is a natural stopping point for me i'm gonna let you all go here thank you for joining me for today's rise of the tomb raider broadcast had a lot of fun got pretty far on the plot a lot of battles and uncovered a couple of tombs all in a day's work i've got to get to work on my next fallout 4 story of fallout 4 lore video if i'm gonna get it done in time i've got a lot to do so cross your fingers that i'm gonna get in it done in time look uh for my video tomorrow on the channel channel at around 6 in the morning. Wish me luck. Thanks again, everybody, for coming. Have a wonderful rest of your Friday, and I'll see you all, uh, all again very soon with more lore videos and more live streams. Bye-bye now.